With Burning Man approaching, people are getting their minds and bodies ready for a week of self-expression. There hasn't been a gathering of free spirits this big since the ending of Casper the Friendly Ghost. Hey folks, welcome to The News Show. I'm Ross Everett and Burning Man is upon us! For those of you unfamiliar, Burning Man is a week-long gathering in the Nevada desert focused on art, self-expression, and expansion of the mind. People attend from all over the world to share their unique styles and thoughts and occasionally drugs. One method of expression at Burning Man that has become quite popular is what people choose to wear. People have costumes and clothing from across the spectrum, and choosing your dress for the weekend can be quite the task. One I was willing to take on. Take a look. So I'm here at Distractions on Hate with Avi Tal, uh, who's going to help me get dressed up for Burning Man. Do you have a lot of people that come in here looking for Burning Man costumes? Yes. So we have tons of people. It's our busiest time of the year. I'm trying to pick out a costume for Burning Man, but I need to fit in by standing out. Mm -hmm. So I have a few costume ideas. So my first idea, I think it would be great if I could dress up like a cyborg Abe Lincoln. Mm -hmm. Can, can we do that? Absolutely. Okay, let's show me yeah, that. Yeah, let's do it, come on. So for Cyborg, uh, Abe Lincoln, what you're gonna want is you're gonna want like a good coat. You said that like you've said that before. Uh... For Cyborg Abe Lincoln, you're going to want a good coat. No, because you're... it gets cold Yeah, so like revolution. something like this one. This is lovely. This is the president part of Abe Lincoln. Oh, yeah. this is really interesting. I can yeah. see all your body information. There you go. Hey, 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 oh, hey, sorry, hey. sorry, hey. eyes up front. Abraham Lincoln needs a hat. He does. So let's do, let's try this one on. Oh, this is very cyborg Abe Lincoln. How does that feel? This feels like it belongs. Okay, Ross, come on. Four score and seven millennials ago today, mm -hmm. the robot population dominated the eastern seaboard and I was born. Do a spin, come on. As your cyborg. There you go. Robot Abe retreat. Cyborg Abe retreat. Let's do David Bowie Batman villain. Yeah. Batman villain. Okay. Yeah. So what kind of Batman villain? <sighs> Ziggy Stardust. <laughs> Ziggy Stardust. <laughs> blows some Ziggy Stardust in Batman's face and then Batman starts to trip. A little bit like the Scarecrow. I have bubbles. Do you want to blow some bubbles in I Batman's think, face? I think David Bowie Batman villain would absolutely blow some bubbles at Batman. What do you think? Uh, this is fantastic. Well, you don't wear your pants up here and sit down there. Oh, well, you don't. <laughs> and of course, every villain needs a mask. Oh, what? This is what really brings it home. Okay, show me the David Bowie uh, Batman villain. Let my acid bubbles wash over you. Here we go. Ch -ch 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 changes. Turn and face the strange. Dragon slut. When you say dragon slut, do you mean a slut for dragons or a slutty dragon? Why not both? Right now, do you, if you're a dragon, are you into this? Um, be honest. Not so much, okay. not so much. So let me find you, like a really fun, oh, that's this a good color on you. great, and yeah. it has like a skeleton there. Mm -hmm. So I don't have any body image issues because I feel thin at all times. Let's, uh, let's see your, come it's on. Dragon slut. Dragon slut, slut that's it, you're a dragon, dragon slut. I don't know why I came up with this one. <laughs> Where's your tail? Show me your tail. There's, is there a tail in the back of this thing? You know, when, here's, a, here's a secret. Uh, when I was getting tailored for my bar mitzvah, mm -hmm. the woman at the men's warehouse said, huh, you don't see a lot of guys with backsides. <laughs> right? Rude! But it's everything you want to everything you want to hear when you're 13. I know, right? It's like, hey, you're awkward. And Today you're I'm a man. But also, you've got a kick in bod. We've been doing yoga at work, so I feel like I'm really feeling this. Oh, you're really good. Yeah. yeah. Our next one is Terror Bird. Terror Bird. Okay. So this year for Burning Man, they usually don't allow feathers. Wait, is that why won't they allow feathers? Um, because you're not allowed to leave any trace of being there. So we have <laughs> our beak. This is like a beak gas mask. Mm -hmm. We this have goggles, wonderful. and then we have our headdress. Let's see what this Okay. Is. How many other people have worn this? You don't know. So show me Terror Bird. I am Terror <laughs> Yes! Come! Ka-ka! Ka-ka! I am the Reckoning! I kind of sound like Bane, don't you? A little bit. A little bit. Yeah. Oh, cool. Gotham is mine. I like this one. This one gets a big old thumbs up. Okay, how about a Viking princess? Yes. So we're gonna size you for a corset. So we're gonna do a little bit of patting down. Have you worn, this a, really have you worn a corset before? <laughs> uh, no, this is going to be a first no, for me. No, this is gonna be a first yeah. one. Okay, we'll be gentle. And of course, at Burning Man, what you're gonna wanna have is lots of pockets, because we love pockets. This is a shoulder harness. This actually feels kind of cool. Yeah. Like, I might wear this every day. Like one of those police chiefs at a district that's like, you're out of line, McNeil. I want to see you in my office right now. Actually, yeah. You're a loose cannon. Okay, Ross. 
Is this a Viking princess? Who's Viking oh, you're princess? Oh, you're a pre-princess. You're a pre-princess. I can't breathe. You can't breathe? <laughs> you can't. Oh. Let me try and look regal, though. Okay, yeah. Show me princess. But <laughs> this is, I gotta... <laughs> <laughs> Don't hurt yourself. I can't look regal. And my life depended on it. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna even want this on him. <laughs> Josh is crying. Look at our producer. He has tears in his eyes. I decree from this day forward that I will never wear this dress again. This is like twerking, but Viking princess twerking. I gotta tell you, it's really freeing. The boys are jumping. Muppet Game of Thrones. Yes. Yeah. So what do you want to do for Muppet Game of Thrones? That's that's why I'm here. Yeah? Yeah. Are you seeing anything on the walls that you like? I, well, okay. This thing right here feels very like, mm, I am the Night's Watch. Like, okay, yeah, let's get that one down for you. This is either Muppet Game of Thrones or if Fozzie got really into S&M. Show me your Night's Watch. Winter's coming, waka waka. <laughs> This is my favorite. This is, this is the I, best. I think this is you. John Snow the Bastard here. Yay! <laughs> Yay! This is this. I think is my favorite. I think this is your. This I think this right. is your uh, Burning Man. I think, I think you are a Game of Thrones Muppet. The Game of Thrones Muppet. <laughs> you do a good beaker face. Yeah, I do a good beaker face. Let's see your beaker. <laughs> so I think I found my perfect Burning Man outfit. Yeah. It's my spirit animal. Yeah, you're looking good. I'm feeling good, you guys. Yeah. Thank you so much to Tora and Avital for, for showing me around the store and helping me decide uh, how I'm going to strut my stuff at Burning Man. Yeah. Well, thanks. thank you guys and I'll see you there. Yeah. <laughs> to Burning Man. Uh. What would you wear to Burning Man? Let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to this channel. You can click this annotation or the link in the video description below. I'm Ross Everett and winter's coming. Borky, borky, dorky, dorky, dork, 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 dork. Here's one more bit. Hold on. I have a breath mint in here. You're bringing a bad name to the... I swear I put him in one of these pockets. There's a Cheerio in here. My son, he's teething. They like to chew on them. I don't... There's a loose Cheerio in here.